Tana River County is a land of alternating flood and drought. In the old days, people moved when disaster struck, but now this is no longer feasible. So today farmers and pastoralists are adopting ambitious climate-smart agriculture projects geared towards improving livelihoods, resilience to climate change, and conserving the 130 hectare Tana River Delta. Speaking during the official launch of the project at Hola in Tana River County, Devolution CS Eugenio Malwa held stakeholders for being consistent in drought risk management across Kenya's arid and semi-arid counties. Leo, nimesikiza sana viongozi wenu wakizungumza hapa, Senator Wario wa Meguzia, vile vile speaker, na wakisema mambo ya wayu, haroresa, Waldena, hizi ni area nimetembea sana wakati tumekuwa na kiangazi, tukiwa na ukame, tumetembea na viongozi wenu maeneo haya yote. Kukiwa na mafuriko kule kwa delta pia, nimekuwa hapa, tukifanya kazi na gavana. Three of the projects were implemented by the National Drought Management Authority, among them a high-capacity earth dam in Kitui, fully equipped boarding facilities in a primary school in Baringo, and rehabilitated and equipped classrooms and girls' dormitory in West Pokot. Na siku ya leo nilitaka tuniwa kikishie ya kwamba kando na huu muradi ambao tumekuja kuzindua hapa kwenu siku ya leo. Muradi wa karibu nusu bilioni 540 billion ile pesa inakuja hapa kwenu kusaidia vikundi kusaidia communities kuna county ya Isiolo tumekuwa kule juzi na nikazindua mpango kama huu tulianzia kule Baringo pia hiyo county ya Baringo pia imeathirika pakubwa sana na mambo ya climate change the CS said that the other two ongoing resilience building projects similar to the one in Tana River are implemented in Baringo and Isiolo counties. Wakiwa na mafuriko huko, wakiwa na ukame, kule pia tulizindua mpango kama huu. Sasa ile county mebaki ni ya West Pokot, na nikitoka hapa takuwa tunapanga kutembelea wenzetu wa Pokot Magaribi, ili ule mpango tumeweka hapa siku ya leo pia, uweze kuwafaidi wale wenzetu walio kule Pokot na haswa mpakani mwa Kenya na Uganda. Tana River County has been negatively impacted by climate change and the COVID-19 pandemic. More than 120,000 people in hard to reach agropastoralist and pastoralist areas are set to benefit from the project which will help in addressing food and nutrition security, one of the biggest challenges in the county. Busara Naman for Ebru TV.